finasteride is not the most effective oral medication for hair loss in 2025. Let me quickly give you the top five. At number five, spironolactone. Commonly used in women with androgen-driven hair loss. It works by blocking the androgen receptor, but it's generally not suitable for men. At number four is bicalutamide, a stronger androgen receptor blocker, useful in selected men and women, but must be monitored. At number three is oral minoxidil. Originally a blood pressure medication, now one of our most versatile tools for hair thinning. It prolongs the growth phase and thickens hair fibers, but dosing depends on person to person. At number two is finasteride. Well studied, FDA approved and effective for most patients when the dose is tailored to their sensitivity and side effect profile. And number one is dutasteride. It blocks both type 1 and type 2 5-alpha reductase enzymes, making it more potent at reducing DHT. It's off-label, but extremely effective when used appropriately under supervision. And how to use them appropriately, and what about their side effects, dosing, etc. Know everything in the full episode, link below.